So we have made it to City Hall. We just watched this guy die. And we didn't try and help him, but we don't care. We really don't seem to feel much sympathy at all. Do you mind if I get to look at your anus? That's a nice little ass you got there. Tight little ass. One mine. Oh, yeah. Report number 00977. Urgent, urgent structural issue. Re-status report. Expansion efforts put on hold. Retention of original map is paramount. In addition to fracturing of land mass and atmosphere control loss, daylight simulation has also been compromised. Oh, that's why it's so dark and shit, I think. I mean, I figure. Uh, daylight simulation? That's so cool. Like, the entire concept of this is so cool. An entire utopia built... I don't know. I just think that's such an interesting idea. It'd be really cool if that worked out. But at the same time, then it would be really boring. Counter measures for system failures have been established, but receiving reports of previously uncategorized issues. Citizens are experiencing memory re rewrites. Also receiving reports of unexplained corporal dysmorphia and violent tendencies. Please advise. This is them turning, it looks like. When they're turning into the baddies. I wonder what happened. Like, I wonder why this whole place fell apart. Is it because of the psychopath? So that way or that way? This seems like the right way. Fuck, I jumped. Scared me a bit. Ooh. Man, this art is so fucking cool. Look at it, it's floating, a body! This is awesome. I know I shouldn't be like, this is awesome to something so fucked up, but it really is. The entire concept's just so fucking cool. I've never heard anything, like, I've never seen anything like it. I mean, I've seen serial killers that kill for art and stuff, in literature and in in history, but it just feels different. That's his M.O. He's somewhere in here. He must be. I don't think that really took a rocket scientist to piece that together, Sebastian. You're not a very good detective if you didn't already realize that by the fact that we followed him in here. His camera's everywhere. I mean, he's always waiting for the perfect shot, right? Never know when it might happen. Some more crappy, weird-ass art. This is garbage. Like, this just looks like splotches. I'm pretty sure that my daughter made this. I'm really loving this game. I feel like I enjoy it way more than I like the first one. I don't know why. I just really like how fantastical it is. And unique. I've never seen or played anything like it. Oh, I have to open the curtain? This is gonna end badly. What's this about? I don't know. You tell me I can't see in there yet. You're in my fucking way. I still don't know. Just looks like a po like a, a, a camera thing. So here's an art piece. She scratched out her face. And these roses. Or take those. Though these flowers are beautiful, something seems off about them. You have a feeling that you should be extra careful with the thorns. Yeah, that's called roses. Don't say stupid shit. Of course! Of course you should be careful with the thorns. Unless they- then maybe they poison on them or something. It's a pretty piece. It's very pretty. I need to add the roses probably to the piece because it looks like it's right there. And that's probably, I mean, usually. What's this? Ah! This expensive looking necklace features a large gemstone. Oh my god, an emerald necklace. Emerald is my birthstone. I'm keeping that shit. Put that shit on, Sebastian. Just kidding. We gotta recreate the photo, I'm assuming. What's this? This is a this camera so old. This is a camera. Must mean something. It doesn't mean anything. It means 
I mean, it's a camera. You're supposed to take pictures with it. Must mean something. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna do this yet because I need to uh, get her dolled up. Her face is scratched out, so that's not a thing. But she needs her necklace and she needs her roses. She has arms in the photo. That's that's a that's an oversight. Nothing. What am I missing? Arms. You're missing arms, honey. Look at the fucking picture. You're missing arms. See, she has arm. Same dress. The focus. Oh. What? That was scary. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, God. That felt paranormal. I don't want to back up. What the fuck was that? Yeah, I know it's the same dress. I think I'm an idiot? No, rotate this way. I did not like things sweeping past and shit. Okay. Um. I thought we were missing arms. But I guess that's all I had to do. It turned real. It, behind her turned real. This is such a trippy game. I love this fucking game. It's gotta be the fa my favorite game I'm playing right now. Not the scariest game I'm playing right now, but I fucking love this game. It's trippy as fuck. I ain't rotating you again. And that puzzle wasn't like too puzzly. Blank canvases. Whole bunch of blank canvases. Soon my face will probably be on those. What's that noise? <gasps> it's gone. It closed. The door closed. Well, this isn't even a door anymore. Not even a... It all shut behind me. I hear like a clock or something. Oh, there's a clock. It's probably that. So there's a picture here. Whoa. Who comes up with this stuff? It's a girl or guy with bloody fingers, blood, and a rose. That's cool! Jesus Christ! This guy is fucking talented. He's not doing it the right way. Like I said, you could just make this a painting. You don't need to actually use real blood and roses. But, that looks awesome. Oh, I can investigate the clock. It's ticking. The pendulum stopped. There's a really big pendulum downstairs. Am I supposed to investigate these? Blank canvases? There's something really creepy over there. Blood, it looks like. Locked. Shit. The lights keep coming on to show off the art. I really do think he wants to show off his art. Damn, that is fucking gorgeous! Sebastian, say whatever you want, but that's fucking beautiful. This is lovely. I love his art. Let me check this one out. Oh, God. This place is getting really weird. Damn. So that's a girl holding a mask with a fucking roses coming out of her head. Ooh, she's got some shears too with blood on them. That is fucking awesome. This is the kind of art I made, you guys. One day I need to do like a like a show off my art thing. I'm I have a dark fucked up mind. So that's cool. I like it. 
I'm not really fond of that piece at the end. It's very creepy. Kind of freaks me out. It says something on these. Glory. Okay, these have titles. Glory. Oh no, it went away. It went away. I didn't read what that said, you guys. Something about art. Something just took a picture of me. Files. Crimson Post article. Another decapitated body found. Shit. I wonder if... I wonder if these are happening inside of Union or if this is happening in the other world. Because, like, maybe... Maybe he was a serial killer before. According to KCPD, the body of the woman was found in Kames Crimson City Park this morning. The victim has been identified as Emily Lewis, an aspiring model and actress. Oh, Craigslist model. He found you on there and he cut your head off and he put roses in it and he took pictures of it. Her head has yet to be recovered, but examination of personal effects found at the scene led to the identification. This is the latest string of unsolved homicides of a similar nature. Lieutenant James Van Kirk of the KCPD Homicide Division has a press conference, held a press conference where he confirmed our worst suspicions that Crimson City may be hunting ground for a serial killer. Yes, this is so fucking interesting. The serial killer was getting his jollies off in the real world, and then he came to fucking Union, and now he's getting his jollies off here. He's just a different method for murder. That's, that's, that's cool. Emily's longtime friend and photographer, Stefano Valentini. That sounds like the bad guy, Stefano Valentini. It's probably him. Because that's a very sexy name. Appeared heartbroken at the news. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, Stefano. It's a terrible thing that happened to my lovely model. At least I was able to capture her essence forever before it was destroyed. Yeah, before you destroyed it. Well, here's the body. I remember this. Still a cold case. Yeah, I figured, because you're like a detective, or you were. Still a cold case. I think you're trying to, I think you're starting to figure it out. You probably should have figured it out back then, too, because it was obviously Stefano. I'm not going to tell you how to do your job, but the photographer, the bad guy. That's Lily. This guy's playing with me. I could have told you that. That's Lily. Thought he was gonna use her as bait to get to get his big ol' favorite art piece. It's making that noise. I'm getting kind of freaked out now. Yeah, this is way scarier. This this fantastical photo serial killer world where everything is like so paranormal feeling. This is way fucking scarier than the other the other existence. There's some blood. He is. He's playing a big old game with you, and you're just playing along with him because you care so much about your stupid daughter that you're willing to do all this crazy shit. She better love you so fucking much whenever you- if you save her, <laughs> cause we don't know you will. What's that? Those are bags full of bodies, it looks like, with blood. Ooh, that's creepy! Look at that, you guys. Beautiful. I love your art. Please don't kill me. 
And if you do kill me, though, make me the masterpiece, please. I want to be the best art piece you've ever made. This one is perfect. Not true, so. <laughs> narcissistic much? Psychopaths are always narcissistic. Look it up. Beautiful. That's the door I just went in, ain't it? I'm scared to turn around. Oh. Oh no. Shit is getting fucking scary. So this is the stuff that scares me. The atmosphere. The paranormal atmosphere. Not the physical beings themselves, but the atmosphere. The flickering lights. Not helping. Oh my god. This is the most scared I've been in the entire game. My heart is hammering. This is, this is starting to feel like scary, like Araya. I'm playing this at night too. I didn't think I'd be that scared because so far it hasn't been what I'd call like super scary, but I'm feeling it now. The static, the voices, the scary shit, the fucking flickering lights. Oh, something's gonna jump out at me, ain't it? Oh, mannequins. I don't like mannequins. <gasps> Aw, oh, they don't have... They don't have physics? That's highly disappointing. I've painted stuff with mannequins, too. I paint creepy art and draw it. I never was a photographer. And, you know, you shouldn't... You shouldn't photograph murder. Sure way to get caught. No, just kidding. It's just also fucking evil. Uh, the Mobius agent in the lobby of City Hall. So, this is... The guy we just watched die, or is this the guy that was hanging over the- Oh, this must be the guy that was hanging in the air. Turned into another frozen display. Poor son of a bitch. If he wasn't dead before, he got thrown off of there. He will be if he ever lands. Shit. So does that mean even suspended in time that they- That they might still be alive with their throat cut open and just hanging there? Slowly dying with blood and- Agony forever? Something over here. Are the mannequins missing their heads? Of course. Of course they are. Why wouldn't the mannequins be missing their fucking heads? This is the most scared I've been in this entire game. I feel very, very, I can barely breathe and my heart is hammering. Oh no. Man, I do not like those mannequins. I do not like that they lost their heads. Who is that girl? Oh. Something moving. Okay, pause. Okay, sorry, I need to talk about what I just thought of. Okay, so the girl that's missing her head must have been the girl that he was photographing because she got her head cut off. She was decapitated. So the mannequins are representing that chick, Emily. All right, now back to this because this is scary as shit, but I didn't know if it was going to attack me and I wanted to get that thought out. Oh my God, it's getting really hard to even move forward. What is that? Probably. I'm scared to turn around. <gasps> what the fuck? 
Man, that was, that was scary. Oh my god, you guys. This game just took a leap. I really thought it was going to just be an action-y game. I thought it wasn't going to have very much scary. I thought it was all physical beings. It's just going to be action. No, 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 no. This took a leap to horror real fast for me. Wow. They're fucking my mind right now. Huge mind fuck. What's that? Is that the mannequin? With her eye cut out? I don't like mannequins or dolls or any kind of form of anything like that. Oh, I'm nervous. The floor's gone. Totally normal behavior, right? Wrong. That's not normal. There's nothing normal about this. Oh, there's stairs. Still nothing normal about this. Faces, faces, it's the same face. The stairs go on forever. Feels like I've been walking for years. But I'm also not in a hurry to find the end of the stairs because it's like, what the fuck's gonna be down there? I don't want to know. Looks like it's... Looks like it's just a floor, but there's blood. Oh, lots of blood everywhere. Blood. One, two, three. YOLO! I don't want to move. Oh, what is that? Blood. So much blood. I'm walking so slow. Oh, it's the necklace and the rose. Oh, this is where she died. There's the necklace and the rose. There's that. There's a mannequin head that just turned into a real head that turned on me and fucking... What are these things? Can I shoot it? Would that be a waste of ammo? Made me feel better. <laughs> 